There's a ghost in the AI world. It's called Nano Banana. It just appeared. No launch party, no big announcement on X. It just showed up on the El Morena platform and started outperforming everything. What makes it so special? It's incredibly good at keeping things consistent. You can change a scene, a person's clothes, or the entire background, and it perfectly remembers the character's face, the lighting, and the mood. Some people are whispering that it might be a secret project from Google, but nobody's talking. The best part, it lets us escape the annoying, restrictive policies of the big models while delivering absolutely top-tier quality. So, let's put it to the test. I'm on their website, nanobanana.ai. Signing up is super easy, just use my Gmail account. Okay, for our first test, I'm giving it a real challenge. Here's a super old photo of a celebrity from the 1890s. My prompt is simple. Turn this into a modern, high quality and full color photograph. Whoa, okay, that is unbelievable. Look at this. The pose is identical, the face is perfectly reconstructed. It even kept the details of the original clothing, but made it look real. The quality is just flawless. Now for a much harder test. I'm giving it a side profile portrait of Trump. Here, the AI has to correctly recognize what the full face is supposed to look like, based only on this one angle. My prompt was simple, make this portrait full frontal. This is tough, the AI has to make an accurate recognition of the face to get this right. And there it is. That's insane. It's perfectly him, it even got the hair right. The AI correctly understood the facial structure and built it with incredible accuracy. This thing is seriously powerful. Let's see how it handles a complex text prompt. I'm gonna give it something with a ton of detail. My prompt is, a rainy night street with pink, blue, and purple neon lights reflecting on the wet asphalt. Glass skyscrapers on both sides of the street with floating holographic ads playing animations. People are walking with glowing cyberpunk clothes and umbrellas. Raindrops are glistening on their clothes and faces. Flying cars with LED lights are hovering in the sky, their lights casting onto the buildings. The scene has hyper realistic details from raindrops and puddle reflections to the texture of metal glass and fabric with cinematic lighting and a light mist diffusing the neon glow. Look at this result. It's jaw-dropping. Every single detail I asked for is right there. The reflections, the people, the flying cars, the cinematic mist, it's perfect. Now, just to be fair, let's see what the competition does. I gave the exact same prompt to ChatGPT. And honestly, the result isn't bad at all. It's a really solid image. And here's Gemini's attempt. Again, this is excellent. They all understood the request. But Nano Banana has a secret weapon, and this is where it changes the game. I'm going to give ChatGPT a picture of Putin, and I'll ask it to turn him into a zombie. And nope, after making you wait, ChatGPT says no content policy. All right, let's try Gemini. Same photo, same prompt. Turn him into a zombie. Gemini doesn't even think about it. A hard no. Safety policies. But like I said at the beginning, policies don't really exist for Nano Banana. And there you have it. It just does it, and the result is incredible. This is as powerful as the biggest names in the industry, but completely unrestricted. Think about the possibilities. There are huge YouTube channels like the Door Brothers that are built entirely on making funny videos with celebrities and politicians. Now you can see the kind of tech that makes it possible. I'm not saying they use this exact tool. You can get similar results with complex comfy UI setups, but this makes that power accessible to everyone. It's also great at merging photos. You can combine any two images to create anything you can imagine. Any person, any joke, any idea. Now for the final detail, the price. The free version gives you four credits, which is enough to generate about two images. The basic plan is $10 for 100 credits, which gets you about 50 generations. So yes, it's a little bit expensive, but for the freedom and the unique power it gives you, it might just be worth it. So we have a mysterious, incredibly powerful, and completely uncensored AI model that appeared out of nowhere. It can restore old photos, create new angles from a single image, and generate anything you ask without the safety filters that hold back the others. What do you think? Is this the future of AI image generation? Or is it a tool that's just too wild to control? Let me know in the comments below. And if you want to see more deep dives into crazy AI tech like this, make sure to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.